Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you are in the registry editor and you're trying to search up something in the registry and your registry editor immediately crashes when you're attempting to run that search. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the star menu and you want to go ahead and just type in CMD into the star menu search. This minute should go back with CMD or command prompt. You want to go ahead and right click on it and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to go ahead and left click on yes. Now I'm going to have a couple commands in the description of my video. It's important you just do them one at a time. First one Please take note that I'm using my drive letter is included in the command. So my Windows installation is on my C drive. So you're going to see a C colon. However, if your Windows installation is on a different drive letter, so such as B, D, E, F, or G, or really anything from A to Z, just swap out that one character with whatever your respective drive letter is. So again, in my case, it's my C drive. So I'm just copying it and then I'm going to paste it into the command prompt. So right click on the top of the command prompt, left click on edit, and then left click on paste. We're going to run the first command here. It should say success when it's complete. Once you've done that one, you're going to go ahead and run the next command here. So again, you will have, you will have to change the drive letter. So you're welcome to just paste it in a notepad file or something on your desktop and then just change the letter and then paste it in as you see in this video. You don't actually have to type the whole thing out all over again. Don't want anybody thinking you have to do that. So anyway, second command here, we're going to right click on the top of the command prompt again. Left click at it and then left click on paste. Paste that one in as well. Should take a couple moments to run here. Successfully process one file. That's what we want to see. And once you're done with that, just close out of here. What you just restart your computer and hopefully that should be about it. So I do hope this brief video was able to help you guys out, and as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.